Hey guys, what's up? And today I'm going to show you the Revolution ROM for Galaxy S2. Uh, I have just installed this ROM and I decided to make a video about it. So, this ROM is actually based on uh, Android uh, 4.1.2 and uh, the developer has, you know, uh, tried his hard to bring the Android 4.2.2 uh, uh, features on Android 4.1.2. So, as you can see, uh, this ROM comes with Galaxy Note 3 launcher. This is Note 3 launcher. Nothing much different, but we have, you know, different kind of toggles than before. As you can see, this is 4.2.2 toggles. We have a bunch of them. Let me show you here in the settings. This ROM actually comes with its own kernel, Revolution kernel, and that Revolution kernel is uh, battery friendly, but uh, you know, you cannot overclock your CPU or GPU if you are, uh, you know, if you do gaming. So, I've installed SIA kernel, and it's working great with this ROM. So, let me show you here about device. And or 4.1.2. So it is a pretty lightweight ROM. As you can see, we have here SIA kernel, and this is Revolution ROM, which is based on Venom. Uh, Venom is also a developer making custom ROM based on Samsung's stock stock ROM. So we have also uh, the uh, Galaxy S4 uh, uh, no actually Galaxy Note 3 keyboard uh, it is not much different from uh, you know uh, Galaxy S4 but it is you know kinda cool on Galaxy S2 so it is uh, kinda very identical to the Galaxy S4 but uh, it's okay and also we do get some wallpapers uh, this these wallpapers are you know this Galaxy S4 and Note 3 balloon life companion those and this is the Note 3 wallpaper and also we get here Note 3 uh, lock screen you can see here that sound and the lightning effect here you can also change it in the settings as you have noticed that we have you know different kind of settings like 4.2.2 uh, you have you know bars here up connection my device accounts and more and not like you know ordinary settings that we have before so I mean, you can also change the LCD density you can edit the quick toggles and there is the S4 Note 3 lock screen and you can also you can uncheck this and you can also have uh, you know your lock screen wallpaper if you want and you can also have Note 3 ripple effect let me show you here as you can see You can also edit this, you know, this is the uh, ink effect, this is called as the ink effect, you can also change the, you can change the color of this ink, red, green or blue, what color do you want, uh, whatever you want. So, it is pretty smooth, it is, you know, pretty lightweight, and uh, you know what they say when uh, bloatware, free of bloatware, it is free of Samsung's bloatware, no Samsung apps. Uh, you know, very few pre-installed apps come with this uh, ROM, and I've also restored from backup. Everything is working great. I've tried out FIFA 14, GTA 3, and Dead Trigger, and actually I do get you know high 3D performance on Dead Trigger. You know, smooth. It is uh, very smooth as compared to the Galaxy S3. Uh, my French Galaxy S3 Dead Trigger performance is kind of totally identical to the uh, Galaxy S2 uh, dead trigger performance due to uh, 
uh, this year kernel on this ROM. So, hope you guys enjoy my video and give this video a thumbs up and I'll see you in my next video. Peace out.